Pisces, Kaisha here. Thank you so much for joining me on my channel, The Butterfly Effect Tarot. Huge shout out to my day ones, my foundation subscribers, all of my new subscribers. Thank you. You are appreciated. And if you're checking me out for the first time and this reading resonates with you or I as a reader resonate with you, I encourage you to please share, like, and of course, subscribe. Okay, Pisces, you know the drill. General energy check, not going to resonate with all of you. So take what resonates and leave the rest. If you find this is not your reading today, that's okay. Click the notification button. I'm sure Spirit will have something for you at another point in time, okay? You tune into what resonates with you. Okay, so Pisces, thank you for checking out the vid. I appreciate you. Uh, don't be shy with the likes and the comments. I'm here for them. And let's jump in. Let's jump in. So I pulled some cards already and we're clarified together. So in the past, you have Prince of Swords and the Hierophant in reverse. So I feel like maybe you started to realize that someone was not committed to you or someone was a commitment phobe or someone wanted something different from you or that you just weren't going to have what you really wanted, that kind of relationship with someone. Some of you could have realized that you want um, an unconventional relationship. You don't want to get married. Or you started to feel like, you know what, maybe it's not in the cards for me. Or, or maybe I just don't want to be in that kind of relationship. Like someone feels, it's like kind of a fear of being tied down. Someone started to feel like they didn't want to be married anymore. Or marriage was not for them. Or the relationship that they're in wasn't for them. It's not what you wanted. Okay, okay, Pisces, okay. We have cards falling all over the place, so okay. We're going to see what else is going on. Spirit, please clarify. Prince of Swords and the Hierophant. I feel like this may have taken you a while to realize this, Pisces, because it's like um, in the past it was like Prince of Swords. You know, so you just started to realize some things. Uh, started to realize some truths. Spirit, please clarify. Yeah, that something wasn't in alignment with you. You didn't like the way how something made you feel. You didn't feel good about a relationship or a situation with somebody. Yeah. To the point where some of you may have been... Uh... Sorry, I said no. That's not it. Okay. okay. Let me pull some more cards. Yeah. Someone in this collective, you felt stuck. You felt stuck in something with somebody that you didn't feel aligned with you may have didn't feel like you were supposed to be with them anymore yeah like, and you wanted to move forward it's like why is this taking so long to get to the next level or why is it taking so long for us to be this way you know that's what i keep hearing be this way it's like you really don't want this kind of relationship do you Some masculine in this collective, you realize that the person you had a child with, they didn't even want children. Mm -hmm. And to you, that may have been off, but, you know, not speaking in defense of anyone, just speaking. Not just because you're a female doesn't mean you want to have kids. It's a personal preference. And vice versa. You know, put the energy where it goes. But you found yourself asking why something wasn't changing, why something wasn't moving forward, why something wasn't in alignment. And you didn't have any confidence in someone anymore. Some of you lost respect for somebody too. Yeah. You don't think that they look after their kids or they're a good parent. But you started to lose... It's like maybe once upon a time you used to put a lot of effort, put your best foot forward with this person. You didn't do that anymore. Because you didn't see the relationship going anywhere. Presently, you have King of Wands. Temperance. This is funny. Maybe this is a theme for water signs because Scorpio got this as well. And you have nine, nine of Wands in reverse. So I feel like you're being patient right now, Pisces. Um, you're passionate, you're committed, you're confident in yourself. Some of you may be a little bit paranoid, thinking that um, people are out to get you or people are talking about you. 
some of it could be in your head, some of it could be true. But either way, it doesn't matter. You gotta focus on the positive things and move forward positively. Like you have the energy for it. Spirit, please clarify. Please clarify King of Wands, Temperance, and Nine of Wands in reverse. Pisces, you gave up. You're being you're being patient. Some of you may feel like you have a lot of responsibilities right now. Mm -hmm. You know you have a lot of responsibilities, a lot of things to take care of. Yeah. And you may be tired of having to balance everything all the time. Wow. So this deck is like doing its own thing. Pisces, you want to do your own thing? Is that what it is? You feel, maybe feel a little bit trapped, stuck in a routine? Because something is, you want something to change. Yeah, Spirit, can I get some more, please? Can I get some more? Yes. Okay. Pisces, you have a lot on your plate. You're building towards a lot of things. You're building towards stability, right? And and you know that whatever you're doing, it has to, it's going to bring in happiness for you. So you're just learning how to be patient. Spirit said, don't give up. Okay, you're almost there. It is work, it is responsibility, but it's gonna be well worth the rewards, right? Your harvest is going to come in. Uh, I'm hearing to tell you, do not judge each day by the, by the harvest you reap, but by the seeds you plant. So you may be working hard towards something and it, it may feel overwhelming at times, but you, deep down inside, you love what you do. Mm -hmm. And it makes you happy and it makes you feel satisfied. So it's like, this is just a part of it. If I wanna live, oh, okay, I'm hearing much is given, much is required. So if you want more in life, you're going to have to do more. You're going to have to be more. So I feel like you're here for it. You just may be a little bit tired. Mm -hmm. Wondering when things are going to finally really be balanced out, right? Mm -hmm. You don't have to worry about anything. Someone is working towards their retirement. Mm -hmm. You feel like you have to catch up? Because you wasted a lot of time with someone or doing something. And it's work. It is. But you can do this. You're very balanced inside, Pisces. I like that. Yes. You're learning how to balance out how you feel about what you want. It's like you want this. You got to believe that you can do this. I just got this for Scorpio. This is I, this is a theme for water signs. You got to believe in yourself. Believe that you can have what it is that you want and that you, you have the potential and you're capable of it. So if you say you want to own your own business, believe that you're capable of doing that. If you want to change your career, believe that you're capable of doing that. You want to be with a better person, believe that you're capable of doing that and that you deserve it. You know, and it's like, um, it's not complaining and whining about the new responsibilities you have. It's more like, okay, well, this is what I want and it's happening. I just happen to have to do this now. <laughs> I got to I got to get a VA now because I have more going on. You're expanding and much is given, much is required. You're going to have to do more. Anything else? And it's, it's coming to that acceptance of this is, this is just what it is. If I want to live at this level and, and. I'm hearing embrace, enjoy this lifestyle. This is what it takes. This is what it takes. And it's not easy. It's not easy all the time, but it is what it is. I got this. I can do this. Just be patient. Continue to balance yourself out. So you're putting the right amount of energy into things. You're not overdoing it. And deep down inside Pisces, you fucking love what you do. <laughs> That's what it is. It's that passion that, you know what? Okay, I'm tired today, but I'm going to get the fuck up and do my videos, okay? I'm going to get get up and do my posts. Mm -hmm. I heard someone say, wreck my set. I'm going to get up and wreck my set. Okay, okay. Spirit, what's coming towards Pisces? What's coming towards Pisces in the near future? What's coming towards Pisces in the near future? i give you guys a good shuffle. You have eight of wands in reverse. Anything else? Can I get one more? Spirit, can I get one more? Prince of wands. <laughs> wow. 
Prince of Wands in reverse. Pisces. <laughs> So please clarify, Eight of Wands and Prince of Wands in reverse. I'll tell you what I'm getting intuitively already. Uh, Pisces, I feel like you're not moving towards any fuckboy energy or fuckgirl energy, and you're not letting like anybody like that like, come around you. Mm -hmm. But whoever you... Well, let me pull some more cards. So please clarify, Eight of Wands in reverse and Prince of Wands in reverse. Pisces, I also feel like you don't want anything to do with anyone that who's in that kind of energy. Yeah. Chrome. You don't want anything to do with anybody who's in that kind of energy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And someone that you're dealing with, they're not coming towards you because they see that you're done bossed up. This is, you're more mature now. You know what you want. You're focused on what you want. Like, like I said, you have a lot on your plate. You have a lot of responsibilities. And this person is watching you. Mm -hmm. They know that you you a whole adult around here. A whole adult. Yeah. Now, they know that they were on some bullshit behavior with you. And that's why they're not coming around. Someone could be thinking about it. But it's like they they look at you like look at where Pisces is. Look what Pisces on. I can't fucking go around Pisces now. Like I'm still on the same bullshit. We're in two different realities now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like I said, look at what Pisces is on now. Being a person of integrity, you're doing the right thing regardless of who's watching or not. Mm -hmm. I can't go around Pisces with that. So some I feel like Pisces. Your energy stops someone in their tracks because they it doesn't resonate with you. Their energy doesn't match yours. So I can make it one more. Someone knows you're an adult and they can't play games as you look at this. They see that you're giving to yourself. They see that you exercise equal reciprocity now. So that is, if you are not giving to me, I'm not giving to you. And fair is fucking fair. Yes, someone, you, your energy stopped somebody in their tracks. Like they can't come around you. They can't talk to you. They don't know what to say. They may get tongue-tied. Someone sends, um, they write text messages and delete them, emails that they don't send. Someone has a file, Pisces, <laughs> whatever your name is in the collective, of all the texts, the emails that they wanted to send you, with some of them have photos on them, GIFs. But they can't because they know they can't come to you with this bullshit that they were on in the past. Yeah, right. Your energy won't even allow it. They have to like be on something. Constructive, positive. Yeah. I also like to, Pisces, you're being a gentle warrior. Like you're recognizing that you get the same energy that you send out. So you just want to do good things in life. Mm -hmm. You just want to be a good person and, and have good things happen to you. You want good karma. But you're not letting anybody take you for no fool anymore, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow, look at this. Wow, Pisces. Let me show you what fell out. Twelve of water, there you are again. Queen of water, there you fucking are again. And ace of water, Pisces! Come on now, come on now. Okay, I hear you. I hear you. This is you right here. Mm-hmm. Pisces, you're not even, you're not doing things that are not productive. They're not conducive to what the outcome that you want for your life. Mm -hmm. You're listening to your higher self. Some of you are listening to tarot or you're speaking to an older feminine energy that's giving you good advice too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Someone said it's you. You're welcome. You're welcome, honey. I'm just doing what I'm supposed to be doing, baby. But you're, you're focusing on your new beginning. That's why you're not going towards anything in the past. Any colors that someone showed you and you didn't like it, you're not bothering with that stuff anymore. Anybody that's in this Lucy, I want to, Lucy Goosey, I want to be for the streets, I have no address, uh, energy, you're not here for any of that shit. You're a whole fucking adult, you got responsibilities, you got things to do. Mm -hmm. You have real shit to focus on. Yes, you do. And that's exactly what you're doing. You're very passionate about what you're doing. Spirit said, don't give up, Pisces, you're almost there. You're going to get what you want. Just be patient and have balance. You got to, um, what is it? Pay attention to the amount of energy that you're putting into things, okay? There's a right amount of energy. Then that's when you start getting into the realm of wasting your time and energy when you're pouring into things and you're not getting anything back. 
So when you're getting a fair return on your investment, then you know you're on the right path. And you are, Pisces. You are very much balancing out your life. Mm -hmm. Learning how to continue. So stay focused, stay in alignment with what you want for your life. Because you're, you're in this energy now where it's like, if it don't make dollars, it don't make sense. And if your vibe does not match mine, you can go fuck yourself. Because I don't have time for stuff like that. I got real shit to take care of. I got these kids, right? They're getting older. My son wants Jordans all the time now. No more Walmart shoes. Mm -hmm. My daughter wants to get her hair done. That's two bills a pop. Come on now. I got real shit to do. I got a bigger place to hold all these kids. I got a big mortgage to pay now. I don't have fucking time for this waste, waste stuff on this waste stuff. No. You're not wasting my energy. No, you're not. Pisces, you are not wasting your energy with anybody. No, because you recognize the value of it. I got this for Scorpio too. Some of you may have Scorpio in your chart. Mm -hmm. Good for you, Pisces. Good for you. I like this. Spirit, any more messages? Any more messages for the Pisces, Pisces Collective? Any more messages for the Pisces Collective? Man holding a coin. Uh-huh. You're focusing on your money. Yes, you are. And for those of you that realize that somebody was on some bullshit with you and you don't have time for it, in the past, you're going to be meeting somebody who has, who has shit, to, okay? And they're going to make time for you and you're going to make time for them because they're coming with a proper offer. Mm -hmm. But Pisces Spirit wants you to continue to focus on what where you're putting your energy is where you're supposed to be putting it in. You are planting seeds right now. Some of you, you're harvesting. But whatever it is you're building, it's going to be big. It's being divinely guided. So Spirit's like, listen, continue to tend to your own fucking garden, Pisces. You're doing exactly what you're supposed to be doing right now. You don't have time for people who want to waste time. You don't have that to waste. You recognize what's valuable. Your time, your energy, yourself. Mm-hmm. I like that. But Pisces, your money is looking good, man. You're planting seeds here. Things are growing. I like that. Very, very nice. Spirit, can I get some practical guy? Oh, Spirit said, pull one more. Pull one more. Why are you putting the deck down, Keish? Pull one more. Okay. Okay. Spirit, any more messages for Pisces? Any more messages for Pisces? Someone you, you started implementing, you took inspired action on some idea. Good for you, baby. Good for you. It's going to be beyond what you've imagined. Mm -hmm. Beyond. You have um, guides helping you as well. You may see shadow figures in the corner of your eye. I'm hearing the veil. The veil. You're on the other side of the veil. Okay. So that's why you're getting, uh, you can follow divine guidance so easily now because you just, you're with everybody. <laughs> okay. You're on physical. You can deal with people. You can deal with entities, spirits. You know what I'm saying? That's why you can get your messages. You're also very high vibing. Pisces, I like this energy that I'm getting. Like, it's it's really nice. This is a high vibrational soul that I'm talking to. Mm -hmm. You just want good things in your life and you want good things to come to you. So you want to be a good person because you understand. You understand the universal laws. The law of karma, the law of giving and receiving, the law of equal reciprocity, the law of action. Mm -hmm. You recognize these things. You ain't no fool, baby. You beyond everybody else. Mm -hmm. Wow. So where can I get one more for Pisces? Yeah. Angel of strength in reverse. And this goes back to nine of wands in reverse. Okay, Pisces? You may feel tired right now. You may feel kind of weak. You may feel a little bit overwhelmed, but much is given, much is required. And there's a reason why all this was given to you, because you can do this. So continue to pace yourself. So it wants you to pace yourself, balance your life out. Make sure that you are putting the right amount of energy in things, okay? If something's not working, don't be afraid to pivot. Um, start to uh, reroute yourself because you, you are going to get what you desire. You are going to get what you're manifesting. So Spirit said, learn how to be strong. This is just a part of it. This is how it goes. Okay? You want to live big life, you have to do big things. But you're a big person. So you can do that. Okay? Beautiful energy here. Spirit, can I get one last card of guidance and advice? Practical guidance and advice? Okay. Spirit said to pull some cards on Angel of Strength in reverse. Spirit, please clarify Angel of Strength.
pendulum of strength. Mm -hmm. This wanted to come out before and it came out again. Some of you really feel tired about, you may feel like you have a lot to take care of. Or, or you may feel like it's just you. Mm -hmm. You may feel like it's always been just you. You always have to do everything by yourself. Spirit said, be strong because you are strong. Remember your inner strength. This is tapping into that inner strength. And no matter what comes, no matter what goes, I'm going to stand right here. I'm going to stand firm and I'm going to do this because I can. This is perseverance. This is resilience. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Ace of Earth. Yeah. Some of you may be feeling overwhelmed at starting some new beginning. You're very passionate about it, though. Okay, so this is a side story I'm getting. For some of you Pisces, you have somebody who may be doing really well financially and they may come to give you an offer. The Spirit wants you to learn how to be strong with this person because this person is someone who will, they lead with their bag, right? So this is someone, they may have a lot of money and they think that they can buy you or buy you back or just give you stuff to get you back. A spirit saying, be strong, don't fall for it. Be strong within yourself. This is also about healing. This person is upset at the fact that you didn't, you don't want to move forward with them. So it's kind of like, it, this is a revenge. I'm going to get you back just to kind of hurt you. Because mm -hmm. they're not going to be nice to you. They just want to get you back. But they really, they still don't have any um, intention of really laying a solid foundation with you and this is someone who's hurt inside they still have you up they still have some kind of resentment towards you or some kind of anger but they may come around like they want a new beginning deep down inside this person they care about you they're just mean mm -hmm. they want to move forward with you but for some of you i don't know who you're dealing with but they were not a good parent they do not twice they, they have two cards of not being a good fucking parent look at this Queen of Earth in reverse. This is not someone who's like a homemaker. I'm not saying you have to be. It's 2022. Come on now. Everybody does their fair share. But this could be someone who didn't want kids or doesn't even really like kids. Mm -hmm. See? Absentee parent. They don't really bother with their kids. I'm hearing neglect, child neglect. They expect you to do everything. So you being with this person could have just been fucking burdensome because you're just like, I, I should do everything by myself anyway. So why the fuck am I with you? Someone may try to give you something to try to get win you back and get into your good graces, but really this person, they're selfish. They're selfish, they're upset with you about something, and they really are not trying to build anything with you. So can I get one more? Can I get one more? They just want to be with you. Someone wants to be with you because of the benefits that you provide, Pisces. Okay, mentally, emotionally, physically for some of you, you got a lot of money, you're very stable, you have a lot of responsibilities, and they're just coming to be another one? Yes. Yeah, this person brings a lot of chaos and conflict into your life. And that's because that's how they feel inside. Someone really needs to let go of some shit. Mm -hmm. I don't know what happened between you two. I could look, but I got another video to do. But something may have happened. I'm hearing major big deal between you and this person. And they still have not forgiven you. They have not let it go. There's a lot of resentment, bitterness here. But someone kind of feels entitled. Like, they're allowed to feel that way. They justify their behavior. And it's like, well, if you want to move forward with prices, why are you still holding on to this? Someone just wants you back to, like, low-key punish you. Like, make you not feel at peace. Bring a lot of drama into your life. Conflict. And things are going good for you, Pisces. That's why your spirit said, stay in this energy. I'm not fucking with anybody who's on some bullshit. Mm -hmm. Be aware of this energy. Someone may try to bring something to you, like... Oh, I'm going to pay you back the money that I owe you. You want to go for a drink or something. Wow. Spirit, so can I get some last words of guidance and advice for the Pisces Collective? All right. Because you're on this boss of energy, Pisces, they know they can't come anyway, right? So they may come like, 
they want to take you out to some really nice over the top restaurant to show you that they have, they have money or something or get you a really lavish expensive gift or something but don't fall for it spirit said don't fall for it i just heard flattery is for fools and you ain't no fool pisces spirit can i get some last words of guidance and advice can i get some last words of guidance and advice do the thing avoid procrastinating today make a confident well-informed decision today some of you this is confirmation and for some of you this is spirit gently guiding you like listen if you know that you need to stay away from somebody and not let anybody so don't waste time with this okay get on it some of you like i said in your boss of energy spirit said get you continue to get organized set reminders in your calendar to take care of business you know what you want much is given, much is required. This is just a part of being big time. You have to do big things. You have to be organized. Spirit wants you to ask others to help you get started on a big task. Continue working on a long-term project, goal, or dream. This is all confirmation right now. And release fears towards an outcome of a situation. Okay, Pisces? This is what I have for you, honey. If any of this resonates, smash that like button. If not, that's cool another time. Spirit said, you have nothing to fear, Pisces. You have nothing to lose and everything to gain. Ah. Pisces, you have yourself a fantastic morning, new year, night, love. And I will catch your beautiful energy on the flip side. Bye.